What's happening, YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. Oh, no. Forgive me. What's happening, Hoodlum Gang? Because I'm talking to the Hoodlums, which is the subscribers and the people who interact on my channel. Uh, YouTube just be hating. That's all you weird custers that be coming up here giving your opinion when it don't even matter over here. Keep trying to tell y'all, but y'all helping me into the algorithm, so keep on hating. Um, it's your boy, Hoodie from the Hood, a.k.a. your friend from that big old end, and we back with another video with my big homie, Trey A. Uh, this one is going to be a story time, man. If you just want to give us a story, um, just let us know uh, what year this took place because I am I like timelines. I'm very, that's like a pet peeve of mine. When I'm watching interviews and they, they, they I get lost in the timelines. Like, okay, so what year was this? So let us know the year. Let us know when this uh took place who was there or if it was just you or whatever what you got for us big homie well shit in that regards um i could come up with shit quite a few but what stands out most to me is as you know man i, you know, I love my neighborhood man you know what I, mean? I love i love all my niggas nigga. i love my neighborhood nigga, a lot nigga. You know, i'm all hood you know what i mean and anywhere i could participate and i can extend myself to my neighborhood i do that so there's a lot going on in the turf, you know what I mean? A lot of in-house shit going on, you know what I mean? Causing people to, you know, not deal with each other, you know what I mean? Motherfuckers standing at a bay, you know what I mean? Standing apart from one another, right. you know what I mean? So, you know, as you know, I'm one of them niggas, I tap into the turf, you know what I mean? I try to find out what's going on and try to address the shit, try to bring the shit to a head, you know what I mean? If it can be, you know, if it can be brought to one, you dig? So when was that, what, 2021? Was that 21, 22? Oh, uh, that was 21, 21 and 22, 21. I believe. Yeah, well, it was at this time that it was like that. So, you know, All I... Right, I, that was 20. Yeah, 20. Pandemic. Yeah. About 20. So I felt the... No, 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 I'm tripping. That was, that was 21 when we was out there. Out there. Like, uh, and going way out there past um, El Cajon City. Yeah, uh, like Lakeside Highway, or something. Lakeside yes. Highway, yeah. Right, so um, I felt we needed... We needed, we needed a way, and we needed, we needed, we needed a place, man. You know, I had never seen everybody together under one roof. You know, the neighborhood, you know, given some at the park was getting kind of a little dangerous. You know, the streets was getting kind of heated. You know what I mean? So having some at the park, you know what I mean, wasn't logic at the time. So, you know, I tapped in with a few motherfuckers out the video, and um, I said, fuck it, cuz, let's get a mansion, man. Let's get something out of the way, man. So they like, you know, they put all the responsibility on me, which I ain't got no problem with. Like I said, I love my neighborhood, you know what I mean? I ain't got no problem sitting on this thing right here all night for them, which I did. It's got on the bus that computer open. And uh, I found a nice ass spot for us, you know what I mean? And um, um, it cost us a little bit, but you know, the cost wasn't an option at that time. Right. You know what I mean? And um, we brought it together, cuz, and it turned out to be one of the most monumental moments um, in neighborhood history, cause right. in regards to uh, togetherness is concerned, you know what I mean? Cause right. I believe everybody there enjoyed themselves, had a great ass for time. the most part. Yeah. And um, and and when you're around your own, when you're around from your babies to your G's, and everybody is in accordance, up under one accordance, and having a great time, man. That 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 don't that can't help but be monumental. Right. You know what I mean? Them are what we call stolen moments. You know what I mean? For I gotta, real. I gotta get that video from the homie from Crippin' yeah. Chris. He got that video. Yeah. I need to post that on my channel. Yeah. Um. So y'all can see exactly what he's talking about. Mm -hmm. Um. I was there. Um. Contributed. My brother came yeah. to us, and yeah. I don't know what he yeah. did with it, but I gave him some money. <laughs> right. Uh, right. So yeah, man, yeah. that was that was that was a beautiful night. Um. And. Stuff like that is rare nowadays, not just in our community, but right. in every community. It's so yeah. much uh, so internal much stuff and bullshit on. going on but, and know, people I, not I wanting to, to be in the same. Again. I tried to do it again, as you know. Right. I tried again the, um, the following year. It wasn't like the year before, but, you know, it was okay. It was right. okay. You know what I mean? And, uh, you know, I'm going to keep giving to my neighborhood, man. I'm going to keep trying to, you know what I mean, bring it together, keep bringing them together, man. You know what I mean? And sometimes in order for us to get get together and get an understanding, we got to get out of the way. Right. You know what I mean? 
And that's what we utilize right. them places for. So that leads me to a question that I've been asking, and I hear different answers when I ask different people. Uh, when is the first time you heard of homies even celebrating a hood day? Like, when oh, was you? Shit. I know you was probably in jail. I was, because they were sending me all the photos. They were sending me all the pictures. But, um, shit, the hood day been going back for, uh, I want to say hood day and the turf probably started in the 90s. It started in the 90s, you know what I mean? And um, the hood was together. The hood was like this. They was solid and they was at one, you know what I mean? You know, the nine was cracking like in what, 93, 94? Everybody was eating off the nine. All right. the money in the turf was coming off the nine. You know right. what I mean? Yeah. Right. Yeah, the hood was, nigga, it was going on then. That's when they was having them hood days. Right. That's when it was great. Yeah, that that, yeah. that kind of match up with, um, I remember I asked Big Ice that. Like, yeah. when does he remember? And I think he said, I think he said he went in in 89 or something. And then he said there was no such thing as it. And then he said he got out in 93 and that was a thing. Yeah. Yeah. So that that add up to what I was told. Yeah. You know what I mean? That's when homie started celebrating it. Um, had you heard of a hood day in any other hood prior to us doing it? Nah. nah. So to your recollection, nah. yeah. we was doing it. Yeah. First, not to say yeah, that we, they wasn't, but as right, far as yeah. you know, yeah, we were doing right. it first. It right. first. Yeah, well, there you have it, man. Um, that's all I got right now with the big homie. Uh, we're gonna come up with some more stuff. Like I told y'all, this channel is not just about me, even though I am your friend from that big old end, but that end is bigger than me. So, you know, I bring people onto the platform. To pretty much um, not tell they not just tell their story, but they everybody's stories is what helped shape me because I'm a part of this. So it wouldn't be none of me without the homies that I bring on this platform. You know what I mean? Because it's a collective thing. So I appreciate y'all for tapping in, and um, y'all let me know, man, if y'all want the big homie to come back. He coming back regardless, but you know I like to engage with y'all. So y'all let me know in the comments if y'all enjoyed this and if y'all got any questions that I will write down because y'all know I freestyle everything. Y'all questions will be written down and the next time I have them on the platform, I'm going to ask him personally for y'all. So y'all stay tuned, man. Like I said, your friend from that big old end, I'm out.